Welcome to my channel crochet skills in today's video I will show you how to crochet a cupcake bookmark so we will start with the slip knot in chain 12 I will go into this second chain from the hook and work a single crochet go into the next stitch work a single crochet go into the next work a single crochet in the next stitch again a single crochet single crochet in the next single crochet single crochet single crochet yarn over go into this last stitch work a half double crochet chain one turn go into the back loop of the first stitch work a back loop half double crochet go into the next and work back loop single crochet so we need to work only in back loops just work a back loop single crochet so this is a very easy method to make a beautiful bookmark you will surely like it ok so now make chain 1 turn go into the back loop of this first stitch work single crochet and in this last stitch only I need to work a half double crochet so I will just work almost 7 to 8 rounds and uh, then I will show you what to do next ok so my 11 rows are completed as you can see that this upper side is a little expanded and uh, this is the, a little narrow so we will just make the edging first this is the upper side we don't need to um, make anything here so what I need to do I will make chain 1 and turn go into this first stitch work a slip stitch work one slip stitch all the way and all the stitches here I will just make slip stitches chain one make slip stitches here as well until I just reached here um, in this center this is the center this here is the center so I will just reach here in the center and now I will just make the cord one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen 17 18 19 20 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 I think it's okay so now I will make chain 3 go into this fourth stitch from the hook and work 5 double crochets I guess 8 are enough 7 and 8 leave this loop insert the hook into this first stitch and pull it through this loop so this is the lower part make chain 1 and slip stitch to close this hole now what we need we will just make one slip stitch into every stitch of this cord just insert the hook make a slip stitch insert the hook into the chain make a slip stitch so this is how I will just reach here and then I will make the rest of the slip stitches and cut the yarn here okay so here is my base and it's ready this is the middle portion this is the bottom here is the base and um, ok so make a slip knot attach this knot to the very very first stitch 
now we will make the icing you can choose uh, color of your own choice so make chain 3 go into the same space work 5 double crochets so we will make 4 5 I think one more six then after leaving a little space I will make a single crochet then leave small space work six double crochets one two three four five and six single crochet in the middle of next two rows again work six double crochets basically we are working on shells five and six work a single crochet make six double crochets to finish this row three four five six work a single crochet onto the edge okay so this is the first row now make chain 3 turn go into this first single crochet work 1 2 3 and 4 double crochets go in the top of the uh, central stitch fourth stitch I guess go into the single crochet and work 6 double crochets into this single crochet so I will make four rows and then I will show you the result okay so I think is also done now I will make the cherry on the top for red yarn go into this top slip stitch chain four yarn over go into the same stitch pull up a loop pull it through two yarn over go into the next stitch go into the same stitch pull through two yarn over go into the next stitch and do it again three times so now we need to pull it through two pull it through two pull it through two pull it through two and pull it through last two so this is our cherry just cut the yarn okay so it's completed i hope you have liked it uh, please don't forget to subscribe my channel like and share my video for any query you can ask me in comment section thank you for watching thank you so much